Okay, so that we can maximize our uh, or um, development, I'm going to build a couple more furnaces. Two going there. I, I thought I was making a second one and helping out, but there you go. I made one. That no, that is helpful. Although I'm now out of stuff to cook, I guess I could move it from. Oh oh, I have some raw chicken. Damn. Oh, there's still one over here. Oh yeah. Okay okay. I'm gonna get my raw chicken cooked. Ooh the lolly la what a day. my raw chicken cooking song. I have those <laughs> extraneous sounds down so low now, but because these headphones are ridiculously loud, um, I still hear them as loud as I did before. Well, um, but they're not gonna record as loud, right? No. No, we've taken care of that. <laughs> okay, so now we've got a couple of chests and we've got some iron cooking. Oh, here's some finished. That'll be good for making more tools. Um, let's see. I've decided that if we start swearing really intensely here, I'll just cover up the swearing with the sounds of kittens purring. Or, or the sound of the sheep bleeding. That might be a little too distracting. Oh, I suppose so. I think distantly bleeding sheep works really well, but covering up other noises with a bleeding sheep maybe is too uh, too intense. Thanks. Thanks for throwing a rock at me. Or whatever. It was an iron axe. Ah, okay. Oh, so hey, even even more deadly. Okay, I have gathered some supplies, um, some tools. Let's see, I'll build a couple more. Um, I've put some shovels and some pickaxes in the chest here for us. Um, since we spent a lot of time in the mine, how about we spend some time uh, like cutting down trees or exploring out here? We could. Um, Let's see, we've got some redstone. We could actually build some compasses and we would be able to find our way back to the spawn point with that. Um, oh, okay. Let me show you how this, let's see if I remember how this goes. And next we build a, um, a working recreation of Fallout, correct? Yes, that's the plan. Here. So if you put the compass in your in your uh, bar at the at the bottom, you'll it'll always point to wherever spawn is. Uh, so if we were to build beds here and um, s click click on them, we'd uh, we'd spawn here, and that's where the compass would point. Uh huh. like to build a bed with me, Misha? <laughs> well, yes. Oh, but actually, um, we will need some wool to do that, and for that, unless we want to kill sheep, which we could, but instead we could use these. 
kill a sh can we not we're abandoning the sheep killing you idea? no That's... you can you can kill the sheep if you want to i'm just giving you another option i don't even see what you gave me my i have too much crap now oh i have an egg can i cook an egg um you can make stuff with an with eggs i don't know what else you can do with it you can make like cookies and stuff what did you give me? I can't find it here. It's shears. Oh, okay. I, well, I found the shears, but I'm confused as to how we're going to use that. Well, you hold it in your hand, and then you right-click on a sheep. Ah. I, I think that's how it works in real life, too. Essentially. And then the sheep becomes naked, and then... It'll, and then it'll take some time for the for its fur to grow back. It's wool fur. It's, I mean, it is fur. Naked. See this naked sheep right behind you? Oh, dear God. Poor thing. It looks like one of those poodles. Oh, yeah. Um. So let's go look for more sheep. Hold on, I gotta, I, if you find one, wait, because I want to try to camera catch you in the act here. Oh, well, I did find one over, um, kind of to the, uh, over here by this pig. Uh, oh, a black sheep. Yes. All right. All right, is the camera, camera going? Yeah. Okay. Oh no, he nearly lost the wool. What happens if we try to cheer the pig? Just mm. nothing. Oh, whoops, I hit him. Sorry, pig. Oh, he's okay. Well, now he, he's gonna drown to death. Oh. No, he'll be alright. <laughs> Somewhere there's a dwarf crying. Oh wow, we're really close to the shale or whatever it is over there. Shale? Uh the sand. Oh yes, it is it is sand. I think I think there is shale somewhere or something like it. Oh, over here there are some sugar cane. We can gather these and make sugar and also paper, I believe. Say it, papyrus. I've heard papyrus as well, but I've always said papyrus. Let me I, go try to shear a cow. I'm pretty sure it's papyrus. It's always been how I've pronounced it. Are you replanting sugarcane? Well, if we plant it, if we plant just the one, it will grow into having three levels. Okay. Uh, so the, the best thing to do with sugar cane is, see, it'll grow to be three blocks high. And what you do is if you harvest the top two blocks and leave the bottom block there, and then it'll grow again. So it'll be a renewable resource. Well, I'm white male, though, so I really want to <laughs> take those down. Of course. Um, okay, it's getting dark, so I'm getting terrified. <laughs> Well, there aren't any bad guys this time, unfortunately, um, so... They have a way of seeking me out. You said everything was fine before, didn't you? D did I? Would I, I say something so. like that? <laughs> my... My trust might never be... I'd never return. That's the way life goes. Naked. Is that our place over there in the distance? Yeah, the one that's lit up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or is that an abandoned Incan temple or something? Some, something like that? No, but there are those. Well, maybe not Incan. There are abandoned uh, temple-looking places in the desert. 
uh, there's all sorts of things we can find if we go exploring. There are there are towns. There's um, witches' cottages. Um, How odd! They're all just randomly made. Yeah. Uh, if we start, if we find diamond, we can make tools to build a nether portal and go to a completely different dimension that has like hellish creatures in it and stuff so that that'll be fun when we find those do do we want to do that i i certainly do okay then and yes because we can do, there's lots of cool stuff down there too there's uh interesting like fortresses and materials that you can't find anywhere else and no one. Okay, there's uh, our bed. You going off? You going off to the hell dimension? I'm just gonna grab a nap then. <laughs> this, did you go back here where the hell? I I, I I went to bed. Click right click on the bed. Oh. CP time. Oh god, oh god, everything's going gray. <laughs> bed terrifies me. <laughs> Don't sleep on that bed. It's a portal to the nether dimensions. <laughs> um. Keeping yeah, an eye on that bed. I want to decorate a little bit. Okay. There's some wooden floors. Let's see. When I, at our, at our other place, I was uh, using, what was it, lavender wool? That was my main decoration. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was, that was cute. Lavender wool. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, well, without, uh, we don't really have that many materials yet since we're in survival mode and we must gather them all ourselves. So I don't have a lot to decorate with here. Um, mm. How do you find things like lavender wool? Do you have to shear a lot of sheep and then mix it with things? Yeah, you shear a lot of sheep and then you make a lavender dye out of different materials. So, um... Man, I mean, there's a lot of crafting. There, there is. It, in, in, my, in fact, it's part of the name, if you, if you noticed. And I hate crafting games. Why are we playing this again? <laughs> it's what the people want, Misha. Oh, yes, the people, of course. It's what all the imaginary people want. On, on this channel, they're, they're imaginary, but they'll, they'll be there, I promise. I, don't, mm. I can't really promise that, but I, I do anyway. Yeah. Um. Okay, so you're just making it homier, right? Now. Yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of um, putting stuff in to make it a little more comfortable to the eyes and to the uh, UI. So I know that Slender Man is already kind of incorporated into Minecraft. Are there um, are there any other? Um, I guess what would the, the urban legends or whatever? Incorporated. I, I think I. To me, I think the most uh, immediate thing to come to mind is is, uh, you know, I imagine there's somebody out there who's been playing Minecraft and something new comes on screen, some sort of new entity, and um, they just think, oh, they they put something new in there, but no one else has seen it. I'm just waiting for these ghost creatures to start appearing that aren't, you know, that are perhaps sentient Don't actually life belong trapped. in the game. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> connection lost again. Um, I don't know, but I, I like your idea. I kind of like that would, that would be, that would be cool to see for sure. I'm, I, I still honestly keep thinking about when we were talking about this, uh, I keep thinking about how uh, supposedly, I don't understand the science behind it, but supposedly scientists have found uh, proof, or uh, if not proof, reasons to kind of back up the theory 
that mm. our world is a simulation, and so I really wonder if, you know, some uh, somebody better defined with better graphics uh, created our universe as a server and just let it run forever. Yeah, but then who created their reality? And is their reality a simulation? And did someone create that? Um, and so on and so forth. Well. That, that would be my uh, response. I'm not saying, like, that... Uh, I mean, yes, I, I like the idea. I've heard it before. Um, I, I think it's a sort of a simplistic version of what that idea could really, like imply but um but that's that's fine that's uh sort of the pop culture version i think what if it's turtles all down Misha? yeah what if Please don't forget me. Don't forget about me. Tell everyone I love them. I will, but it'll be really awkward when you jump up and just be like, oh, wait, never mind it. I still hate you all. <laughs> I'm now cowering in fear away from that bed. <laughs> okay, so it's starting to be light again. Do you want to try exploring a bit? Sure. Okay. Are we going over to the sand? Uh, yeah, let's head in that direction. My uh, compass does not seem to be pointing back to our home base. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, well mine is, so hopefully mine is just now, don't get but... separated from me. Oh, here's some rabbits. Hello, rabbits. Oh, I'm going to try to share it. That rabbit just pooped at me. <laughs> that was. Well, what? That rabbit just pooped at me. I, I, does the is that programmed into the game? Maybe that's that uh, ghost activity that you were talking it's about. Just before. something, something brown fell out from behind the rabbit. Hmm. That's apparently what Mojang has been spending their time on. Like, we will surprise and shock viewers with the new rabbit poop edition. Oh, little cave here. Love finding these little caves. I, I do actually, yes. Caves have lots of resources. Mm. Um. Let's see. I just want to see if it goes very deep. Not really. Okay. Oh, here's another one. Now this. Uh, oh, it doesn't go very deep either, but this is made out of sandstone, which we can harvest and use to build things with, so I'll take a little bit of that. Oh boy, this seems to be taking a while here. What tool are you using? A iron axe? Hmm, yes, that is not the appropriate tool for the job. You'll want to use a pickaxe. But an axe? an axe. Oh, yes. Um, of course, but there are, there are different levels of axe, you see. <laughs> oh, whoops, my axe got destroyed really fast. Um, that out there, da 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 da. Wow, Misha, you 
have a really nice axe. I'm glad you noticed. Yeah. So I'm assuming with the sandstone or whatever, we aren't going to find lava over here, right? Probably not. It's it's always a possibility, but usually lava is uh, a lot deeper down. Mm. Sometimes you'll even ah. find lava on the surface, though. Okay. How I've, deep? I've gotten quite a few uh, blocks of sten sandstone, so uh, I think that's good for now. keep trying to fly and I'm not able to. <laughs> I, re I really just, what I want out of this game is to be able to put down torches every six feet and a sign every three. <laughs> That's, you know, you found your, you found your Minecraft niche. That's, you know, everybody plays this game differently because it's just, it's a sandbox game, right? It's open to to all sorts of different play styles, and you've just happened to find yours. Yeah. Oh, is that a cactus? What do we get if we destroy a cactus? We get cactus bits, all right. Yeah. Cact if you uh, go too close to the cactus, it'll hurt you, um, but it'll also hurt enemies, so you can use them for defense as well. Uh, oh, we found a wadi. Uh, an oasis? Yes. What did you call it? Wadi. How do you spell that? W A D I. Hmm. Maybe. Eh. I don't think I know that word. I don't know if I'm using it correctly. I also don't care. <laughs> oh, hey, here's some of the lava on the surface I was talking about. There you go. Don't fall in. I am playing this game like like a six-year-old playing uh, Mario Brothers, just fear and trepidation at every turn. I see. That's uh, that's a good way to play. Um, I found some roses. I'm gonna gather them for decoration. Mm. So by gather, you mean destroy? By gather, I mean gather. You have to move them one, from one place to the other in order to gather them, so yeah. I am gathering this tree. Because it's white, and I figure that's uh, kind of... You didn't even trees? pick up the wood, though. Here, pick it up. Oh. Are you am out of I inventory just... space? Yeah, I guess my inventory's full. Oh, I guess we should. We could go back home and. Um, Hold on here. I can stack my wood planks over on top. Oh, are those not? Those must be a different type of wood. Okay. Oh, no. Keep hitting the wrong thing there. Okay. There, I grabbed some of these. I gathered them. Um, I am also running out of uh, inventory space, though, so why, why don't we head back for now and store right, some of our things? Let's not follow the compass. Uh, no, we do want to follow the compass now. Well, but mine's wrong. So. Okay, well, we won't follow yours, then. Oh, well, looks like you took some damage there. Mm-hmm. But I heal it almost immediately because we're on peaceful mode. But uh, so you'll heal faster in peaceful mode. But if you if you fall in the lava, you Whoa. could still die pretty easily. I just fell somewhat. Hold on, oh. I gotta get my way out here. I don't There's a little Whoa. baby rabbit. Can I feed it? I, can't, I don't have anything to feed it. What would it eat? Maybe carrots. Uh, the cows eat wheat. Uh, horses eat apples. Ocelots eat fish. 
Sugarcane, lilac, grass. Mm. Oh, that was a really localized downpour. Just for you. I guess it thought I was stinky. domain. Oh, I, I remember what I was thinking of. So I work with one of those people who just uh, like has not the slightest, like not an inkling of a problem solving bone in their body. You know oh, what I mean? Like, fun. Okay, like, yeah. like the first sign of any sort of difficulty, they're just like, oh, this doesn't work or whatever. Right. Mm -hmm. And so I imagine them playing Super Mario Brothers, and it's like, oh, well, I tried, but this mushroom kept killing me, so I stopped playing. <laughs> yeah, I think I've encountered people like that. I like how every now and then you look back at me in kind of a taunting way, like, hey, speed up, jackass. <laughs> No, 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 it's friendly. I'm just making sure you're still there. No. Don't worry. I would say, where the hell are you? If I wasn't still there. Yeah, I suppose that's true. There's a chicken. Hello. Oh, there's an egg. Thanks, chicken. I have an egg. There's another egg. Was that a giant rabbit? Oh, no, that was just four short. Again, that's how. Again? Um, wow. I keep surprising yeah. you. Yeah, I keep thinking we're just gonna have giant rabbits in there. Oh look, is this the thing we planted? Is this what we planted? Yeah, I remember you I'm, planted I'm, that. I'm tree. drowning. Remember that tree you planted in the garden? Now here's the tree and the oh, garden. Oh right. What kind of tree did I plant? I don't remember. Looks like an oak tree. I remember that from our first video, which. I'm sure anybody listening to this has watched dozens of times. Yeah, yeah. You probably know it backwards and forwards. That perennial favorite. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put up all the plants in this chest. So I'm going to take a bunch of these out. Maybe we need a new chest. We, there, what, like the one over here? This one. No, like a third one that doesn't exist yet, of third course. One. Fine, yes, of course. Why don't you build that one for us, will you? If you remind me how to build a chest. I don't think I know how to build a chest. It's pretty easy. It's like the furnace, just with wooden planks instead. Ah, okay, so all those wood planks that I just took out of my inventory. Oh, do they have to be Planks, or... Okay, I have planks. What happens if you, like, put fire in the middle? Does that do anything? Do you have fire to put in the middle? I have a torch. Oh. Yeah, that probably won't do anything, but it doesn't hurt to check. I'm gonna try putting a lilac in the middle. It doesn't do anything. How about some redstone? Then it's a program. Oh, hey, that makes a note block. I don't know what that means. Here, I have a present for you. Uh... Okay. Oh, is that some lavender wool? This is magenta dye. Wait. So you can combine okay. this with wool to make... to make your, uh... Your yeah, favorite, do I... Favorite carpet. Do I craft it, or...? I actually don't it? know. I've never done dyeing of fabric in this game, so... Um, I imagine you take some wool uh, and... I got it. I got um, it. So that'll create... Oh. I accidentally oh. tossed it. But there, I guess you you can have it. Well, you, you oh. can have it. It's it's that... Uh, you yeah. um, uh, but yeah. that cr 
created the wool. I'm not sure how to create the carpet. You might be able to take three blocks of wool and put them next to each other. Or or something oh. similar. I keep opening up that stupid thing then. Okay. Hurricane. Grass. Lilac. Gold ore. Stone, I'm sure. Fence. Okay, all right. Iron mushroom. Okay. Now, hmm. Chest is pretty. with a big chest. Oh, this is a small chest. How did I make a small chest instead of a large chest? Well, you can make a big chest by making two smaller chests and putting them side by side next to each other. Ah, okay. Not that I have anything against a small chest. <laughs> Wanna make that clear. Okay. of uh, crafting. Won't let me place this chest here. Oh yeah, you can't place them directly next to another chest unless it's the same chest. So you can do, you can put it there. Aha. Now, we have this chest for other things. Excellent. <sighs> I don't know. I think I still prefer you. <laughs> I don't have a good response to that, I'm sorry. I think this has been a pretty good session. What do you say we call it for the night and come back for the next video? All right, that uh, sounds good to me. I will, oh, is it CP time? Is that what it is? Is it CP time? Yeah. God, oh God, everything's going great. Everything's going great. Tell the children I love them. <laughs> look at, look how cute it looks when someone lies on the bed. Here, turn around. <laughs> You have this pickaxe sticking up <laughs> right from your midsection. It looks a little disturbing. Oh, that's fun here. There you go. Aww. Here, come here. Come here. We gotta do our sign off kitten fight. Oh, yeah. This is our uh, what have we used for that? Stop it, you fem. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mom. <laughs> All right. Okay, thanks for joining us, everyone, and we'll see you next time for Ice on ASMR. Bye.